the New York Post. The, always does the one, I, the one I, I thought it was going to use. I found there are two: the Daily Mirror and the New York Post. Those uh, two, like my, mine's out of Daily Mail. Uh, okay, all right, good. Works too. Yeah. All right. Well, let me bring mine to you. Wait, you're my, first. Well, oh, yeah. yes, you are. Okay. <laughs> well, but yeah, sure. uh, mine is out of China. This is a gentleman again on his first day on the job. Was he in a uh, wet market? No, no, no. <laughs> Although he may have been safer at a wet market. He was at a uh, hot air balloon show. Okay. And uh, it was his first day working at the hot air balloon show. I swear, show. if you say his leg gets caught in a cord and he gets lifted in the air, and oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm hoping that big flame. <laughs> oh, yeah. Incinerates him. No, he was um, actually kind of in charge in ho- of holding the balloon down. He was ha- hanging on the edge of the basket. You know, while it was on the ground, he was just holding on to it to keep it down. Although, it, I mean, it's, it has a bunch of stuff to hold it down as well. Yeah, why wouldn't you just tie it up? Yeah. No, He's there to hold it down, which really is actually not his job. According to the people who hired him, they said uh, he really wasn't supposed to be doing what he was doing. <laughs> They're like, hey, come over here. Help me out for a second. <laughs> supposed to be laying bricks. What are you doing over there? Yeah, so he, um, the balloon started to go away. You know, started to fly. The hot air balloon started to go up. With nobody in it? No, the, there was a guy in there to fly it. Oh. And uh, this young man, his age is, I believe, 20? Hmm. Yeah, right. Jeez. Okay. He's a student. I know that. So um, he, instead of letting go, he just <laughs> held on to the edge of the basket. <laughs> <laughs> and After I, about five feet, I drop immediately. Yeah. yeah. No. <laughs> Forget this. I'm jumping. Yeah, well, he kept going up with the hot air balloon the guy not tried to pick him up and help him well the guy in the balloon didn't even know he was yeah, he got on. that loud flame going on he, probably he had no him. idea anyone was actually attached to this hot air balloon so I'm sure this is the actual if you're a professional right balloonist you would know <laughs> oh my gosh what is that him falling oh my gosh that's him falling that's a picture of him falling from the actual oh, hot air balloon. Uh, yikes <laughs> yes so it actually got higher there's a video attached to it um and I watched the video because it cuts off. It doesn't, you don't see him at the ground or anything like that. But If you're curious, go to our YouTube channel and watch this. Yeah, video. I can play the video if you'd like. I'm not sure you'd want to. No, that's fine. He flies much higher than this. I mean, probably twice the height. And that's when it looks like the guy inside the hot air balloon realizes there's a dude hanging on to the edge of this basket. Over oh, here. my gosh. He starts gosh. coming down. What, and he starts how do going you not down. let go of it? What's he... <laughs> <laughs> he starts coming down. And it, everybody, even the cameraman, looks away like, okay, it's going to be fine now. They're coming back down. They get down to about, it says about 30 feet. And uh, he lets go. I'm couldn't not sure if he couldn't, couldn't hang on any longer. He couldn't hang, hang on. on. It wouldn't be on no. purpose. Maybe he thought it was a safe distance. Compared to where he was, it was much less. I mean, 30 feet isn't much compared to where he was. That's pretty weak. Remember that guy a few weeks ago who was hanging on in the river for hours on end? I mean, this guy's. You know, a few minutes in the air. <laughs> I mean, it's his job. He should, he should be stronger than that. <laughs> have First day on the job. Hey, I think that guy last, last week we talked about in the elevator who fell down. I think it was his first day on the job, too. Yeah, I know. It was two weeks in a row. First day <laughs> on the job. Well, it's like the sequel to uh, Up. Just down. I recently watched a video of a hang glider <laughs> who the trainer on the hang glider took off and the guy wasn't strapped in yet. So yeah, he was just... I saw that, but okay. it's, it's an old video, I think. Yeah, and that guy hung on for a long time. Long time. He ended up ripping tendons in his arm he held on for so long. It's amazing. This balloon so, guy was up for a few minutes, not very long. Well, I'll send you some balloons. <laughs> Easy. Just thanks. He Before Adam got to that one. Uh, you, I was going to send, since they have like the balloon festival here on the 4th of July, it's going to give you some tickets for you and your family to go and ride in a balloon. Thanks. Wow. Would you guys even go in a hot air balloon? Nope. Yeah. No, I know Ben would not. Ben won't even drive on the like at a normal hill off the edge, like near the edge. (laughs) No, true story. We were going up uh, this mountain. It's not a mountain. It's like a it's a hill with a flag on the top of it. But the road was pretty steep, and I got about thirty seconds into the drive, and. uh, told Lindsay I had to put it in reverse and go back down. I'm not going to continue to drive up this. We're done here. <laughs> <laughs> Can't handle this any longer. It was like a paved road, too. So. <laughs> uh, yeah, you couldn't pay me enough to go inside a hot air balloon. I just... I think you could. 
It depends on how big the basket is. If it was big enough where I didn't have to look over the edge, then you I could just lay down. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if I told you we would have a hundred thousand subscribers on Patreon because you went on a hair a hot air balloon, would you go? Yeah, absolutely. Well, we could pay you enough then. Okay. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, maybe.